Ever wondered how your favorite ballpark snack is made? Today, we're diving into the delectable world of hot dogs. Picture this, a sunny afternoon, the crack of a bat, the roar of the crowd, and the unmistakable aroma of hot dogs wafting through the air. Yes, we're talking about that quintessential American favorite, the hot dog. A staple not just in ballparks but also in backyard barbecues, picnics, and even on the streets of our bustling cities. Hot dogs have a rich history tracing their origins back over a hundred years. Immigrants brought the basic concept to America from Europe, and it was here that the hot dog as we know it was born. Over the years it has evolved and adapted, reflecting the diversity and ingenuity of the American culinary landscape. From the classic New York dog with mustard and sauerkraut, to the fully loaded Chicago-style dog, there's a hot dog for every taste and preference. But there's more to the hot dog than meets the eye. Behind each juicy, flavorful bite is a fascinating process that transforms simple ingredients into these beloved snacks. The process begins with meat, usually a blend of beef, pork, chicken, or turkey. This is combined with fat for richness and succulence and a mix of flavorings like garlic, paprika, and mustard that give each hot dog its unique taste. And let's not forget the preservatives that ensure our hot dogs stay fresh and safe to eat. While some dedicated hot dog enthusiasts might whip up a batch at home, the vast majority of hot dogs we eat are produced in factories. Why? Well, it's all about scale. Factories can churn out thousands of hot dogs in the time it would take you to make a dozen at home. Plus, they have the equipment and expertise to ensure each hot dog is consistently delicious and safe to eat. So, next time you take a bite out of a hot dog, remember there's more than just flavor in that tasty treat. There's history, craftsmanship, and a whole lot of love. Let's unwrap the mystery of how these tasty treats are made. Hot dogs start life as a blend of meat, fat, flavorings, and preservatives. Now let's peel back the layers of this culinary delight. First, we have the meat. Beef, pork, chicken, and turkey are the usual suspects in this lineup. These meats are ground up into a fine mixture, providing the base for our hot dog. It's like the canvas for a painting, but instead of paint, we're using meat. Next, we have the fat. Now, I know what you're thinking. Fat? Really? But before you turn up your nose, consider this. Fat is the secret ingredient that gives hot dogs their juicy texture and mouth-watering taste. It's the unsung hero of the hot dog world, working behind the scenes to make every bite delicious. Then come the flavorings. Garlic, paprika, mustard. These are the artists that paint our canvas, adding depth and dimension to the hot dog. They're the ones that give hot dogs their signature taste, turning a simple meat stick into a culinary masterpiece. And finally, the preservatives. Sodium nitrite, the most common preservative, is added to keep the hot dogs fresh and extend their shelf life. It's like a personal bodyguard for each hot dog, protecting them from spoilage and ensuring they're ready to be enjoyed whenever you are. But it's not enough to just have these ingredients, they need to be mixed together in just the right way. This is where the magic happens. In a large mixing tank, the meat, fat, flavorings and preservatives are combined to create a homogeneous mixture. It's like a dance with each ingredient moving in harmony with the others to create the perfect blend. And there you have it. The meaty mixture that forms the heart of every hot dog. It's a symphony of flavors and textures, all working together to create something truly special. Once the ingredients are all mixed up, it's time to shape our hot dogs. But that, my friends, is a tale for another time. Stay tuned. From the mixing tank, our future hot dogs are headed for a sausage stuffer. Now this isn't your grandma's kitchen tool. In a hot dog factory, a sausage stuffer is a large, high-powered machine. It takes our well-blended mixture of meat, fat, and flavorings and transforms it into a continuous stream of hot dog goodness. You could say it's the link between the raw ingredients and the final product. Get it? Link? Alright, moving on. As this stream of potential deliciousness emerges, it's met by a rotating blade. Now this isn't some sinister horror movie contraption. It's a precision instrument, slicing the stream into individual hot dogs with the exactness of a seasoned chef. Each hot dog is cut to the perfect length, ensuring uniformity and consistency in every pack. Next up, we have the cooking process. And this is where things really heat up. Our hot dogs can either be boiled or smoked, and each method imparts its own unique flavor and texture. Boiling is like a hot tub for hot dogs, cooking them through in hot water until they're fully done. It's a straightforward method, but it leaves our hot dogs plump, juicy, and ready to burst with flavor. On the other hand, smoking is like a day at the spa for our hot dogs, exposing them to smoke at low temperatures. This slow and steady process gives the hot dogs a distinct smoky flavor and a slightly firmer texture. 
It's a bit like the difference between sunbathing and getting a spray tan, both get you to the end result, but the journey is quite different. Cooked to perfection our hot dogs are now ready for inspection, but we'll save that for our next scene. For now, let's just savor the thought of these perfectly cooked, deliciously flavored hot dogs, fresh off the production line, and ready to satisfy your cravings. So the next time you bite into a hot dog, remember the journey it's been on. It's quite a tale, isn't it? Quality control is key in hot dog production. This statement is as true as a dog's love for fetching. You see, every single hot dog undergoes thorough inspection before it gets the green light to proceed to the packaging stage. This quality control process ensures that only the best of the best make it to your plate. Inspectors with their eagle eyes scrutinize each hot dog for color, texture, and fat content. Hot dogs that look like they've spent too much time in the sun or those that didn't quite hit the gym enough are shown the exit door. Only the ones that are just right with the perfect balance of color, texture, and fat content make the cut. It's like the Goldilocks of hot dogs, if you will. And it doesn't stop there. The meat used in the hot dogs must be USDA inspected. That's right, even before they become hot dogs, the meat is inspected to ensure it meets the high standards set by the U.S. Department of Agriculture. Now that's what we call thorough. Once the hot dogs pass the inspection, they're ready for their next adventure. Packaging. You might think packaging is just about making the hot dogs look good, but there's more to it than meets the eye. Hot dogs are usually packed in vacuum-sealed plastic packages or cans to ensure they stay fresh and tasty. And let's not forget the labels. They carry vital information such as the expiration date, ingredients, and nutritional information. It's like the hot dog's passport, detailing where it's from and what it's made of. And to ensure all this happens smoothly, advanced machinery and equipment are put to work. Conveyor belts, temperature-controlled smokehouses, and more, all work together like a well-oiled machine to ensure efficiency and quality. So the next time you take a bite of a hot dog, remember the meticulous process it went through to get to you. From rigorous inspections to careful packaging, every step is taken to deliver the best to you. With the seal of approval, these hot dogs are ready to hit the road. From factory to store our hot dogs are on the move. Now, you may be wondering how do these tasty treats make their way to your favorite baseball game or backyard barbecue? Well, it's quite a journey let me tell you, just like a major league pitcher, hot dogs have to be in top form for their big game day. That's why they're transported in temperature controlled trucks. These aren't your average delivery vehicles. Oh no, they're the limousines of the food transport world, ensuring our hot dogs remain fresh and safe for consumption. It's like a spa day for sausages, only cooler, literally. But before they embark on this chilled out journey, they're all tucked in. Proper packaging is crucial. Each hot dog is snugly wrapped up, usually in vacuum sealed plastic packages or cans. It's like they're getting ready for hibernation, only to be awakened by the sizzle of your grill. The labels on these packages are like the hot dog's passport. They include important information like the expiration date, ingredients and nutritional information. They're the hot dog's ticket to the big leagues, or in this case, your local store or stadium. Once they arrive at their destination, they're carefully stored. This isn't just a nap in the fridge, it's more like a tactical operation. Proper storage ensures that our hot dogs maintain their quality and safety, ready to spring into action when game day arrives. In conclusion, making a hot dog isn't just about mixing, shaping, and cooking. It's a meticulously planned journey, from the selection of ingredients to the final delivery. It's a process that ensures every hot dog is a home run, every time. So, the next time you're chomping down on a hot dog, remember the journey it took to get to your plate. Think about the care that went into its creation, the journey it embarked on, and the quality checks it passed. It's not just a snack, it's a masterpiece in a bun. Enjoy!